did you know that the average person spends 80 hours a year looking for a lost item? That's true. It is a national crisis. And I am on a mission to help everybody live an organized life so they will never have to experience the frustration of trying to find a lost item. A few years ago, I went to school to become a certified image consultant. And in my line of work, we meet the client in their home. That way we get to look at their closet and um, see what we have to work with. And in every case, I'm amazed to see how much stuff people have. There is no way you can be organized when you have just so much stuff in one house. So I then decided, I think I need to help people because you cannot have an organized mind. You cannot have an organized life when you have so much clutter in your space. Your space is supposed to be a sanctuary. So I came up with five tips. Number one, use the Ohio system, O-H-I-O. Only handle it once. If you're coming outside, it's winter, you got a heavy coat, you got gloves, you have a hat, before you sit down, hang the coat in the closet, put the gloves and the hat where they belong to. If you're coming from the dry cleaners, before you sit down, go to the closet, put the clothes where they belong, put the hangers and the plastic wrap you don't need and recycle them. If you're coming home, put grocery bags, before you sit down, put the food on the shelves in the fridge and the freeze where they belong, put the bags away where they belong. Even when you get your mail, before you sit down, when you bring them in the house, go to your home office, Put the mail where it belongs according to whether it's a bill or other kind of correspondence. And if it's junk mail, do not throw it away. Call the sender and say, do not send me any more junk mail. I did that, so I do not get any junk mail. You can do the same thing um, if you're getting something in the mail, email, because you might think, oh, it only takes a second to delete. No. That second adds up when you have 20, 30 of them coming your way. So declutter, declutter your life. Number two, have a designated space for everything you own. If you come to my home and you ask me to show you something from 20 years ago that I bought something, whether it's whatever it is, I can show you within seconds. Why? Because for everything I own, I have a designated place. It takes just the same amount of time to put things in the right place as it does in the wrong place. So once you designate a place for everything you own, it is so much easier to maintain the organization. Number three, declutter your home once a year. Whether it's in the spring or before the new year, just go through your closet, for instance. And if you see something you haven't worn in one year, you don't need it hand it on to a charity because you'd feel so good that your closet is light and organized and neat and you have all the space now. And number four, know who you are. I know who I am. Nobody can sell me anything that is not true to who I am. A lot of the times I go to my client's home and I see all these clothes with the tags on and I say, why did you buy this? Oh, because I saw it on the model and it looks so beautiful on her. I'm telling them, that's what models do. Whatever they put on, they're supposed to make it look so good so you can buy it. But when you knew that this is not really you, you still bought it anyway. So know who you are. Don't let anybody persuade you to buy anything that is not who you are. Lastly, you deserve the very best. Buy only the best. And instead of buying 10 things that are bargain, it's better to buy one thing that you absolutely love. Every time you wear it, you feel good. And this way you're not collecting just discounted stuff, but you're just having quality things. Because at one given time, you're only gonna wear one item anyway. So why would you need all that 10 stuff? So ladies and gentlemen, I do hope 
using the Ohio system, having a designated place for everything you own, declaring once a year, knowing who you really are and what you want to buy for yourself and what you'd want to look like, and then finally buying the very best because you deserve the best. These methods will help you be organized so you will never have to experience trying to find a lost item.